When the Earl of Wessex, Prince Edward, arrived in Northern Ireland, his first port of call was the Loch Erne Golf Resort in Enniskillen. During his visit, he stopped in on a few golf training sessions and fly fishing classes being carried out by local youngsters taking part in the Duke of Edinburgh award scheme. The Duke of Edinburgh, it's, um, you do a range of things like a service, service community, you help out volunteering, um, then you have the physical education aspect where it's just to keep you fit and healthy and then you have a skill, you develop your skill and at each stage there's like different, you can do it for three months or six months, it just depends what level you're at and then the gold one you do um, a residence, we go away. It's really good, you get to meet new people and the people you meet, it's just a good experience. Like uh, We just came out here today and um, met the Earl of Essex, we were canoeing on the lock and then we met him and he discussed the Duke of Edinburgh with us and what stage we were at. Some of us were at um, bronze, silver and gold level. It's just a good experience, like outdoor, wouldn't be doing this here, like out canoeing, it's just very enjoyable, so <laughs> enjoy it. The 600 acre locker and golf resort opens its Nick Faldo designed course later this month and Fermanagh Council Chairman Bertie Kerr believes it's the perfect setting for a royal visit. It's tremendous to have a royal visitor to, to set off the opening of it and uh, to give it the prestige it deserves and I am delighted that uh, Prince Edward has been able to come along and uh, see for himself the beautiful scenes in Fermanagh and this uh, tremendous complex that we've got uh, put here in the last few years. It's like a dream come to for us beleaguered from honour councillors who've been trying to get an investment like this for about 30 years and uh, we're a tourist county this is the sort of thing we need uh, to build our reputation to make use of our asset of lakes and uh, beautiful views and all the rest of it. You only have to look around the place here to see the design of the buildings, the quality of the finish, uh, the way the grounds are laid out and kept and this fantastic golf course, uh, we're hoping that it would be probably one of the, the top five in Ireland. It's a jewel in the crown again for Fermanagh tourism.